ever licked a lamppost in winter? <laughs> I have licked my CM lamppost and then some. Why? Just a why. Hello guys and welcome back to some more Dragon Age Origins. We're gonna talk to our companions and then we're gonna sell a little, a little bunch of stuff. A bunch of stuff, a little bunch. I don't know, a lot of stuff. Uh, some questions maybe? Do you have any? Uh, can you teach others to be a Templar now? Others, yes. But not yourself. I need someone who's trained first as a warrior. It's as much about discipline as anything. I guess if I'm going to give up Chantry secrets, I may as well go all the way. Send whoever you want trained to me in camp. And I'll see what I can do. All right. Thank you very much. Something on your mind? Some questions. Uh, why have you remained a Templar if you hate Chantry? Have you seen the uniform? It's not only stylish, but well made. I'm a sucker for good tailoring. In that case, you should have become a mage. Oh, you aren't kidding. I think the Templar uniforms are as colorful as they are, just so the Templars didn't feel dull in comparison. Last thing you want when you're about to take down some Maleficar out in the woods is to have him point and laugh at your taste in clothing, am I right? You're right, buddy. Yeah, it seems, seems like that might happen anyway. Oh, ow, ow. Stab wounds to the pride of the worst. You don't really want to know about my being a Templar, do you? It's really quite boring. No, no, you know, I do really want to know, yeah. Poke, poke, poke. Tell me everything about your life, Alistair. All right, if you insist. It's not like we have anything better to do, right? The truth of the matter is that I did hate going to the monastery. The initiates from poor families thought I put on airs, while the noble ones called me a bastard and ignored me. I felt like Al Eamon had cast me off unwanted, and I was determined to be bitter. But I took some solace in the training itself, I guess. I was actually quite good at it. What did you enjoy about uh, the training? The education, mostly, but also the discipline. You need to have a disciplined mind in order to use the abilities we have. It was difficult, but rewarding. I never really felt at home anywhere, though, until I joined the Grey Wardens. And Duncan felt my Templar abilities might be useful for when we encountered Darkspawn magic, so I kept it up. What about you? Do you have anywhere you consider home? Home is wherever camp is, where we are travelers now. Yeah, home is wherever the camp is. We're travelers now. We won't always be traveling like this, you know. Once the war is over, once the blight is... Well, a time will come when we'll have to think about having a real home again. I guess that is true. That seems like a far ways off. And I suppose the Grey Wardens are gone for good. Either way. They can rebuild. I suppose you're right. We can create new Grey Wardens, but we'll never get back those we lost. I wonder if it would ever feel the same. Anyhow, now I've sidetracked us. We'd better get back to what we're supposed to be doing right now. All Something right. On your mind? Some questions. Of course. Why do you keep your birthright a secret? You never ask. That's a cheap answer. <sighs> All right. If you want the full explanation, I'll give it to you. The thing is, I'm used to not telling anyone who didn't already know. It was always a secret. Even Duncan was the only Grey Warden who knew. And then after the battle, when I should have told you. I don't know. It seemed like it was too late by then. How do you just tell someone that? You just tell them. It's that easy. Hey, how about, by the way, I'm the heir to the throne? Yes, well, I suppose part of me kind of liked you not knowing. Why? What happens when people find out? They treat me differently. I become the bastard prince to them instead of just Alistair. I know that must sound stupid to you, but I hate that it shaped my entire life. I never wanted it, and I certainly don't want to be king. The very idea of it terrifies me. Doesn't sound stupid at all. For all the good it does me, 
My blood seems certain to haunt me no matter what I do. And now Arleman plans to put me forward as the heir. It never ends, does it? And for what it's worth, I'm sorry for not telling you sooner. It was a dumb thing to do. Don't worry, apology accepted. I guess it's kind of a relief that you know now. Let's go. Plus one only, yeah. Something on your mind? Have some questions once again, you know. I'm always, you know, about the questions. If you were raised in the Chantry, have you ever, have you never, never, never what? Had a good oh, wow. oh, I see what it's okay. Oh. Uh, you know what I mean. I'm not sure, I do. <laughs> have I never seen a basilisk? Ate jellied ham? Have I never licked a lamppost in winter? Are you just making fun of me? Make fun of my comrade in arms? Perish the thought. Well, you tell me. Have you ever licked a lamppost in winter? <laughs> I have licked my shell lamppost and then some. Why? Just a why? Why, well, yes, I've licked uh, a lamppost in winter. Just the once? And you didn't lose half of your tongue in the process. <laughs> I'm impressed. I myself never had the pleasure. Not that I haven't thought about it, of course. But, you know. Oh, I see. You like the proper parts. Oh, that's funny. Your cruel japes will be remembered, sir. If you hear sobbing later. Let's be crying myself to sleep. At least you'll get some decent rest. Ha ha ha. Your cruel interrogation will be remembered forever. Or maybe just until lunch. Lunch makes everything better. Oh look, I have cheese. I have some nice conversation. Something on your mind. Some questions. Don't worry, we're not gonna talk about lamppost again. What changes about you after the joining? You mean other than becoming a Grey Warden? You've been a Grey Warden longer than I have. Hmm. You know, I asked Duncan this too. And all I got was, you'll see. He wouldn't tell you? Oh, it's not that Duncan wants to keep it a secret. It's just that the Grey Wardens don't discuss it much. I gather it's not a pleasant topic. The first change I noticed was an increase in appetite. I used to get up in the middle of the night and raid the castle larder. I thought I was starving. I'd slurp down every dinner like it was my last, <laughs> my face all covered in gravy. When I'd look up, the other Grey Wardens would stare, then laugh themselves to tears. I mean, I haven't felt anything like that. Really? I saw you eating dinner the other day. Savage. I doubt that's true. I guess it affects people differently. Regardless of the cause, you're still a savage. <laughs> oh, and then there were the nightmares. Duncan said it was part of how we sense the darkspawn. We tap into their, well, I don't know what you'd call it, their group mind. Oh, hive oh, mind, sleep. okay. It's even worse. You learn to block it out after a while, but at first it's hard. It's supposed to be worse for those who join during a blight. How is it for you? Nightmares, yes, I know what you mean. Some people never have much trouble, but that's rare. Others have trouble sleeping their entire life. They're just more sensitive, I suppose. Everyone ends up the same, though. Once you reach a certain age, the real nightmares come. That's how a Grey Warden knows his time has come. What are you talking about? Oh, that's right. We never had time to tell you that part, did we? Well, in addition to all the other wonderful things about being a Grey Warden, you don't need to worry about dying from old age. You've got 30 years to live. Give or take. What? No Eight. one told me that? It's a death sentence. Ultimately, your body won't be able to take it. When the time comes, most Grey Wardens go to Orzammar and die in battle rather than waiting. It's tradition. 
Why, why, why didn't they tell me that? Why, uh, 30 years to live? Why also, man? What, how teary, huh? And you wondered why we kept the joining a secret from the new recruits. Well, there you have it. I feel betrayed. This is wrong. You think if we asked for volunteers that Grey Wardens would exist? Maybe a few. You wouldn't be here. Neither would I, probably. And the blight needs to be stopped. You know, Duncan... He started having the nightmares again. He told me that in private. He said it wouldn't be long before he'd go to Orzammar himself. I guess he got what he wanted. I just wish it had been something worthy of him. You will be remembered as Alistair, as will the others. I know. Ending the blight should make this all worthwhile, right? Oh yeah, minus three. Well, I wasn't the one who lied, was I? Severin, what's what up? You? Can these others be an assassin? Mm, I could teach others, but not yourself. First, I would need someone who has training as a rogue. That is, unless you would care to spend the years it takes to gain the fundamentals. But if there should be such a person who desires this training, yes, by all means, send them to me. The crows are already furious, no? I shall enjoy tweaking their nose further. Okay, so I can do this again now. That's great. What about you, Stin? 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 You good? Yes. I want to discuss Speak something you mentioned, eh? No, that's enough. Just we move on. All right, a question. I am hardly surprised. Never mind. Well, as you wish. Let, let's go. I don't know about you. You haven't really opened up much. If there's anything I can do for you, please, please tell me. You heard any rumors? The dark spawn have attacked Lothering. I don't think everyone even had fled by the time they came either. Word has it they swarmed the entire area, making off with prisoners and burning down the buildings. And then they were gone. Just as quick. I wonder if Dang. anyone left. I heard some chanters were going to head down south, maybe to try to find some survivors. I'm not holding out hope myself. That's what I've heard on the road, anyhow. Take it for what it is. Okay, I'm where's... sure you'll be pleased with the goods, my... Yeah, the discount and goods. Yeah, that's that's good. What's this Herman staff? I mean, it's not a good staff by any means. Already changed the inventories before I do this. Quartz, garnet, diamond, emerald, totem. I need to give this to someone. A uh, small wooden totem with figures of demons and other strange beasts carved into it. That has to be for, um, whatever she's called now. <laughs> Morgan. Franca's shield for defense to damage versus beasts. Rock shield. Okay, all right. Let's see. Um. Oh, Morgan, not Morgan. Here you go. Interesting. Only one. So that wasn't for you. That, that, that doesn't make any sense, though. Oh well, I suppose it's fine. Uh, is this any good? Doesn't increase my spell power at all, so no thank you. Alice there, what about you? This is three, five... Dark spawn and beasts. Actually, yeah, take this instead.
Uh, what about this one? This has healing effects, but it's pretty much the same the same thing, right? Looks like it. Very chill main boots, you don't need that. Alright. The rock knocker. Time for win. I did increase your strength a bit, so you could get something else, but it doesn't seem like there's something you need. Except this, I guess. Okay, here we go. You are two-handed user, so I need you to have... We played armor, I can give you that. There you go. You already got good boots. Same with gloves. We have this one. Better. For some reason. Oh, you're gonna have that. You can still use this, right? I think so. What about this? This is better, though. Uh, anything else you can have? You can have a leather armor, dust is leather armor. It's better. Could also know that the other one you have is better. All right, cool. Then what about you? Have this helmet if you want. Dalish gloves, elven gloves. This is this. Already got boots, heavy chain mill boots. What about this? I already got better one. What about dwarven armor? You already got better armor though. Very sad, very sad. Uh, what about this one? About the same. I mean, you're gonna have this one. Better than nothing. There you go. 28 strength. Stamina regeneration. Actually, this one. There you go. Morgan, what kind of staff do you have? You have that one. You can take this one instead. We got the dog, Hugo. Don't need anything for the doggo. If there's anything I can do for you. To see your ass. Lifestone and demonic potion. I get rid of this one. Uh, 36 strength. This one, I can get rid of that one. Get rid of these Danish gloves. They're too weak. Also too weak. Chainmail. Put up an armor, go away. Get rid of these shields. Oh, okay. This one is actually not that bad. Oh, it's Aegis. I guess I can put that on armor. Eight. So I need to double check Alistair here. Your shield does what again? It 
this is shield down here. Four, one willpower, plus two defense, electricity, and attack. Yeah, they, there you go. Now, Sten, you can use this. There we go, that's better. If there's anything I can do for you. Again, your wares. Uh, let's see. Anything else? Old Kiva is outdated by now. Um, outdated. Chainmail outdated. Get rid of this one. Damage versus Darkspawn. I mean, I'm, I will be fighting Darkspawn in the future, but still not yet. So these damage versus Darkspawn, I'm going to have to get rid of. That leg sugar, that one. Okay, sure now... I can't interest you in wait, there we go. Uh, what were you saying again? There was something here I wanted. Some of a keen technique. Uh, give me this. And physical technique. Uh, Templar Helm. Nope, nope, nope. Don't need any of that. 13. This, this is the stuff I gave to you. You're selling it back to me for a more, a more expensive price. That's a little bit mean. 87 gold. Yeah, alright. That should be good. Now let me use that. Uh, restriction warrior rogues. I need them in my party to be able to use that, but that's fine. Uh, so I go in here and I go next. What is that? What should I get? So what should I get? I could get a powerful uh, Inferno ability. Uh, all targets the area, constant fire damage. I mean, sure. Because if I use that instead of my uh, floating thingy here, then that should be fine. Getting a few upgrades. Alright, Hugo, what's up? Bounces around you, barking excitedly. Pet Hugo, there you go. A little, just a little petting, it's fine. Uh, no. I'm not planning on leaving just yet, but I'm leaving right now to get to the mages thingy. They had a stay if I kind of want. Uh, Alistair and Win. I think. I'm still considering whether to take Lelena with me. But I don't think so. Yes. Because uh, we're going to the circle of Magi. You went above and beyond the call. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. You. Let's take my leave. What about you? My men of scout. You are very thorough. I'm impressed. 
All is well, I'm afraid I can't stay. Yes, yes, okay. Oh, where is the, uh, the girl? But first of all, the staff. I'm sure you need supplies after that. Let's trade. Tome of Arcane Technique. Ooh, another one. I mean, I don't really need it, though. Oh, this needs 128. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> maybe I should not get that one. A bit too much for me. So, I don't know if I have the strength for another big battle. The Grey Warden saved us. But where is she at? Because uh, the thingy should be somewhere around here. The dwarf girl. Come on, you've rested enough. We need to get these out of the tower before they get fragrant. Touching those abominations. So, oh, has anyone figured out where I can find the, the dwarf girl? He should be somewhere. Studying. Hello. I wish I could have gone with them to fight. Yes. I guess you can talk to the um the other guy. What was his name? Uh, the one who is one of those people without emotions. Right here somewhere, right? No, he's not here now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Maybe I just need to head down again. I was hoping to talk to the dwarf girl, but it seems like I can't. All right, all right. Let's uh, move. Nothing in there. Okay, at least I can use the tome now. Or not. But I want to use this as like... Oh, I, okay, I can just swap two of them and then use it. Okay, at least I use it. Right, use rally. Or get rally. You could show me a little appreciation, you know. Appreciation? For what? I saved your ass a while back. When that thing was... You go. When that thing was... Was what? Let's go to Flamet's hut to see if we can defeat her now. Maybe I should wait. Yeah, the encounter is... Yeah, I'm gonna have to wait. Okay. Yeah. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, though. If you did, click that like button. If you want to see more from me, set for 8,000. Hit the subscribe button. And I hope to see you in the next one. And as always, stay awesome.